we need electricity. As populations grow, countries develop and industries boom, we need more. Energy consumption is growing dramatically in many parts of the world, and some countries expect domestic demand to even double by 2020. Each nation has different energy needs and has to find the best way to generate its electricity. This depends on its natural resources, the demands of industry and agriculture, and lifestyles of the people. There are several ways to produce electricity. Some rely on the forces of nature. Others burn fossil fuels, oil, gas, or coal. One option is nuclear power. There are currently over 430 nuclear power reactors in 30 countries. More than 60 new reactors are under construction and many more are planned. A nuclear power plant uses uranium as fuel. Fuel pellets are combined into large fuel assemblies and placed inside a reactor core. In the reactor, the uranium atoms are split. This releases energy that's used to boil water and produce high-pressure steam. The steam turns a turbine connected to a generator which produces electricity. Nuclear power can help provide the reliable amounts of electricity a modern economy needs. It can reduce a country's dependence on imported fuel, and it's an environmentally friendly option. Today, most electricity generation is dependent on fossil fuels. When burnt to create the heat needed to produce electricity, they pollute the air. They also release huge amounts of greenhouse gases such as CO2 that contribute to climate change. In comparison, CO2 emissions from nuclear power plants are extremely low, even lower than from hydropower. Nuclear power is not without its challenges. The costs of construction are high. But, once built, plants are cheap to operate and provide a steady supply of electricity at a stable price. Like most common forms of electricity generation, nuclear power produces waste. Methods for disposing of waste with low levels of radioactivity are well established. The highly radioactive waste, such as the spent nuclear fuel removed from reactor cores, accounts for only 3% of a power plant's waste. It's currently stored close to the reactors. Eventually, this type of waste will be disposed of deep underground, where geological conditions are stable and it can be isolated from people and the environment. As with all kinds of industry, accidents can happen. Like the one at Chernobyl in 1986 in the former Soviet Union. And more recently in 2011 at the Fukushima Daiichi plant in Japan. Soon after this accident, member states of the International Atomic Energy Agency the IAEA adopted a nuclear safety action plan. Based on the plan's recommendations, safety measures and emergency preparedness are being enhanced throughout the world. The IAEA provides assistance to its member states at all stages of a nuclear power program. 
It advises nations that are considering introducing nuclear power and those constructing their first nuclear power plants or building new ones. The IAEA offers services to ensure the safe operation of reactors and the security of facilities and nuclear materials. Its safeguards inspectors make sure these materials are not misused to make nuclear weapons. The agency also helps with decommissioning when a nuclear power plant reaches the end of its operational life. Our daily lives depend on a reliable supply of electricity. Modern cities and major industries already consume vast amounts of energy. And our world is getting bigger, faster and busier. Investing in nuclear power is a major and long-term commitment. But if it's done safely and securely, it can make an important clean and long-term contribution to meeting growing energy demands.